New World is introducing a new profession and I have to say it's actually pretty fun. That profession is called music which is actually why I'm wearing my headphones because my daughter is in bed. So let me jump in game and I'll show you it. So I'll explain where I am in a minute but if you press escape and you go to character and you go to trade skills you will see a new one under the category of casual. However I will say that the expert modes of this don't seem very casual to me because I'm pretty bad at it but if I click it it doesn't really reveal anything so this is isn't particularly useful to look at but if we go into my inventory you will see here there are five new slots these represent five new instruments the flute a guitar the mandolin an upright bass and some drums okay now I've got these blue ones because on the PTR basically they give you a box of instruments right so this is why I've got like gear score 400 stuff because it just gives you it however on the PTR right now is this going to be the summer festival so when the summer festival goes live you're really going to want to come here here and like pay attention to them it's this symbol here and just keep in mind that you can actually just fast travel directly to it you don't have to fast travel near it and then run to it you can go directly to the point then you will talk to a the maestro who's the guy up there right he'll give you a quest and basically that first quest you'll run around and you'll loot i think maybe all five of the instruments now from what i can work out the music involved in this quest and this summer fur is sort of separate from the music long term like that music as a trade skill is going to stay but this is just the way of its introduction so even when this goes away you'll still be able to do the music but it's just a good way of maybe getting started because you'll pick up some instruments so for example i think this is the first instrument you actually get which is like an apprentice guitarist cachet or cash i don't know why i said it so weirdly you get a guitar and then you get this sheet music and i'll sort of explain what that is in a second as well you simply then equip your guitar or whatever it is i'm not going to do that this time then once you've got your music equipped you have to press f5 right I'm too close to somebody else. So there's an area. So somebody else is playing music over there. If you're too close to them, you can't play your music, right? Keep in mind that if you go into the woods, an animal can attack you whilst you're performing your music and it will cancel your song, basically. Hopefully I'm far enough away now. So then you get this menu. I can't move or anything like that at the minute, but one of the key things you're going to want to press is R to song select. This just means that I've done it on perfect, I think. Basically, you can pick the difficulty of the song. So you can see uh, you can do it on novice or skilled or whatever, right? Obviously, I but being very difficult so let's just say here that i pick this bloom and breathe right this number here is the number of pages that you find if you can see look where it says that my uh, page is found now i'm not 100 sure how you're going to get pages in the long run the quest itself here from this summer fur will give you some pages but on the ptr they literally just have like a, a, a box of them so you get them all presumably it's just going to be world drops right you make your song selection and you can see here okay let's say i select this um, i'll explain what these are in a second actually i can't start the performance right and the reason for that is because i've not actually picked my instrument so in this case it's the guitar okay let's say i was on this uh, blacksmith arm one i've not found the pages for anything else so i can apparently do the drum but i can't do the rest of them if that makes sense but just even though it says here that, that it requires four people it doesn't actually require four people it's up to four people so you can still play this as a solo basically and you can see now i can perform that song here i will pick the guitar now this basically there's different buffs that you can get if you you saw the ptr it's basically you can get loot gathering buff you can get gathering yield and stuff like that that so you're going to be able to pick your reward okay so this one's gathering speed and this one is territory standing bonus right N not particularly great once you've got that you can see here i can now start the performance or i can exit right if i start now you can see i've already perfected this one so don't judge my playing ability here. i'm not actually going to play it for you let me just make sure the audio's on so we can actually hear it so i'm not going to click the start performance bit and uh, so basically i'm not going to press anything here but basically you can see how there's letters on the screen that corresponds literally to the keyboard letters so up down left right etc wasd that's a double like mouse click a button there is a one at the bottom which is also a space so they're the six things that it can be it can be wasd space and double mouse click basically so down left you can see there's an arrow on them as well so that sort of tells you a little bit like what to press when i was first doing this I couldn't, my brain was not really corresponding WASD in the head, like it, it, it didn't necessarily logically make sense. But once I realized there was an arrow, basically chat told me there was an arrow, I found it a lot easier to actually sort of like time this, if that makes sense. So I'm not even looking at the screen because I was looking at the camera, but you can sort of see that's what you do. It's basically Guitar Hero, right? <laughs> that's literally all it is, it's Guitar Hero. You can see in the top of the middle of the screen, it tells you how long the song is going to be. And uh, yeah, great, that's, that's literally all it is, right? 
and uh, it plays you a nice lovely song i'll just uh, wait for this one to finish up but yeah uh, okay if you if you mess it up then you just get an x right but um whilst the easy ones are sort of even i can do them the expert ones are a bit trickier so you'll get a level of performance here ranging from uh, i don't know if you can get zero stars but you can get one star to like four stars that one was bad but i, have, I already four starred it so don't hate me then in theory if you see people performing you can tip them like one gold so if you do this in a tarot you might actually get tipped right but i'm just going to exit this and uh and that's it you would also get experience right at the same time i think you might get experience if you do anything other than bad i'm not sure so just for comparison what we'll do is i'll pick the same song and we'll do it on uh, expert right i'm not going to be able to do this so don't judge me but that's that's the space button right so it's like uh, i'm not going to be able to do this one and vaguely talk but uh <laughs> consider i've never done it before okay 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 you can see you can see it's obviously uh, much harder, right? I'm not a guitar. I've never really played Guitar Hero or anything like that. So I'm not going to be able to be very good at it. But you can see that's what you would do. OK, so you can see it's the same song, but di a different difficulty, basically. Now, it's a little bit tricky for me to show you. But if you're in this menu, there's nobody near me, right? But if I was in that menu, you literally point at people and you can press L, I think it is, and you invite them to perform with you. And the more people that are in it, the better it is kind of thing. So that's sort of it in simple terms but I just want to show you how you're going to be able to craft these instruments because there's some interesting thing there that you might want to pay attention to market wise or you might just want to like prep it yourself I'll just keep an eye out see if I can see anybody like playing some songs together oh this guy okay play it I wonder if this guy will maybe invite me oh they've got a bat they they are doing the song together you can see it here right oh well they look like they were because they've got their instruments out so they've invited me um I don't have this one I don't think oh well I'm gonna try it anyway okay consider I've never done this song this is gonna be interesting I may just just skip this but you can see here we're playing together basically he invited me if i was the one who started it you literally aim at somebody and press l basically okay okay we're playing it okay i'm just gonna skip because i won't be able to talk during this okay so i was bad at that so we'll be interesting what we actually get song wise i will ditch after this because i probably brought them down but i got xp for that and it was great okay i will uh, ditch because i was quite frankly an embarrassment i also don't want to wait for that so i'm not gonna ditch but you can see there we played with uh like i said we played with each other the pages by the way i mentioned them you literally just salvage them and then you get it basically you just salvage them and then you have them now there is one thing uh, part of the quest that you have to do from this like summer fur kind of thing on the map and I don't know if I can find one here's one you have to go and basically play a specific song in that swarm that's part of the quest for the summer event I don't think you'll be doing that generally when it comes to this profession so the first thing we'll look at is the furnishing bench but the workshop right you can scroll down to the section called instruments and then it just says instruments I'm a little bit in the way here but um, I won't move myself and basically these are the materials you need for the level 151 so you need ironwood planks oricalcum sandpaper stain catfish whiskers for this one but it's not always catfish whiskers and some snail slimes for example now the composer's upright base is basically just the earlier version of it so you basically to make the end one you have to build the first one and then the second one and then the third one very similar to trophies in that sense and then the only thing that's really questionable apart from these catfish whiskers right which i tried to buy on my server but they were all sold out i don't know what the market's going to do with them because uh, you know it's uh, anybody's guess kind of thing but this blue stuff well they are come from different uh they come from different crafting stations basically so for example here this is the this is the one i find the most funny is the fact that basically a pearl plectrum requires 25 bricks <laughs> right plectrums are generally like this big so i'm a little bit confused by that but it is what it is so you can see there's just different requirements to make them right nothing nothing amazing maybe the brilliant pearl could go up because you require them for this maybe so yeah there's not really much else to say like i'm not 100 sure where you're going to find these pages or if you can sell them or anything like that but the whole system i have to say is just more interesting than i thought it was going to be it's literally properly like guitar hero in new world and you get little buffs from it like yeah i have to say all in all i think it's just great it's just a nice little addition it's probably worth doing now if you can get in the summer fur like when the patch actually goes live just so you can get like a basic guitar and stuff like that the reality is you'll probably be buying crafted ones and stuff like that so i wouldn't really worry about it too much but um maybe as part of the quest you have to do that like specific song in a specific area i'm only on quest two at 
at the minute. Maybe once you get down the line, there's maybe more difficult things to do or whatever. But right now, like New World's newest profession, weirdly, really exciting. And that's because it's got everything you want in it, basically. It's got collectibles. It's a fun kind of mode. There doesn't really seem to be any like massive reward really tied to it. So it is really quite casual. They have it in a casual section. And I agree with that. Even somebody whose timing is literally awful, I'm probably going to like do this a chunk. It's just fun every now and then. And I like to see things that sometimes are just fun, even though people are complaining maybe that, oh, there's bug fixes and stuff like that that need working out. Well, yeah, but sometimes you need a little joy in your life, I think. Let me know your thoughts in the comments below how you feel about this. I'm really happy it's a thing, but let me know your thoughts. If you want to support the channel, then becoming a member would be the best way to do that. Generally, obviously, that's more of a live stream thing. But if you wanted to do it, if you just can't catch my live stream, I would greatly appreciate it. It really does help with the support of the channel. So please do consider that. Like and subscribe. Have a most beautiful day. Goodbye.